Yung Chuchu de Jaye de Chu Senghor. Today's title is The Inner Lifestyle of Spiritual Leaders. Chondo Jaye de Chu Kulil. In other words, it's an inner training of the evangelists. Let's look at the Word of God first, Philippians chapter 3, verse 7 to 14. Yeah, let's look to the verse together. Again, Philippians chapter 3 from verse 7 to 14. Let's read the verses together. But whatever was too much to profit, I now consider most the sake of Christ. What is more, I consider everything a loss compared to this requirement of grace. For whose sake I have lost all things, I consider that I have gained Christ. Found in me, not having a righteousness of my own, but the love of God, which is the love of God, and the love of God, and the love of God, and the love of God. Realistically, there is a need of uh, there is need of training for the uh, the evangelists, the inner training of evangelists. Well, we just heard it. Let's look at the introduction first. It says Daniel was a captive in Babylon where he came face to face with the regulations and laws of the strange foreign land that seemed to completely opposite to him. Even in the midst of rampant violence and idolatry, he became a government official and revealed God's glory. Then, what was his inner lifestyle like? Together with the method, we need invisible training. Even if our discipleship and evangelism training are complete, without inner training, we will fail. Paul, he revealed God's glory in prison. What was his inner training like? So if your inner world is not trained very well, but when you encounter problems later on, then uh, you may crumble because of the inner problem. So in many cases, a lot of evangelists, because of their inner motive, they sometimes stop doing the evangelist movement and also they fall into trials. Because what had been imprinted in them was not the gospel, so that's why when the problem comes, they easily crumble and they fall into trials. But these problems are hidden, so they are not aware of that. Outwardly, they receive so many trains, but uh, inside, actually, they haven't trained their inner self. That's why when problems come, because of this, they easily they crumble. 
That's why today we will talk about the inner training or lifestyle. So let's first of all let's look at the Paul's work of faith. So today's passage is about the Paul's confession of faith. This is not just a, a simple testimony, but uh, he really confessed his faith. He said he wanted to be found in Christ. And he said that he present to take hold of death for which Christ Jesus took hold of him. He said that he present to take hold of death for which Christ Jesus took hold of him. He also present to win the prize for which God has called him heavenward in Christ Jesus. Yeah, for the prize of heavenward. And also Galatians 2.20, he confessed that I have been crucified with Christ. It means I no longer live, but Christ, he lives inside of me. Jesus also, also he said that, that if you want to come, uh, if you want to follow after me, but you have to deny yourself and you have to take up your own cross daily and follow me. So self denial. So Paul, he had this kind of training. So we also need to have the similar or same training like Paul. But if you, if we truly find the Christ in us, then uh, we will be just like Paul too. So this morning I already mentioned about this during the public message. Our inner world is really important. Without us realizing it, a lot of things are become imprinted in our subconsciousness. It's because we have lived our lives not knowing about the gospel, that's why so many incorrect things have become imprinted in us. Yeah, having all these incorrect imprints with us and then we also receive training at the same time. But these also incorrect things are hidden, so it's not visible. But these hidden things, problems, when you go out to the field, these become, begins to reveal. So even for men, uh, you know, unless you get married to him, you wouldn't know the man uh, properly. And also you would not know the spiritual problems that this person have. But once you live together, all these problems will be revealed. So if you live together with this person, then all the hidden problems of this person will be revealed. So this much, you know, all the incorrect things have become imprinted in us already. Why is missionary training so important to us? Because once you live together with the people, then you will know the inner spiritual problems of the people. So one of our remnants called the Jungwan, he reported me that uh, he is entering into the mission of Chumpe Church. So he actually uh, requested me of a recommendation letter for the entering Yeah, even he have he has to pay for the fee because uh, about three hundred thousand. 
Yeah, this mission arm, they really good at training these uh, young remnants. 두 달만 그 안에 살면요. 다들 합니다. 성격 뭐 아니 영지 문제 막 이런 성질이 다 드나가. If you live inside of this mission arm together at least two months, then the, all your inner problems will easily be revealed. 그거 끄집어내고 그냥 그거 가지고 이제 진짜 실험하게 돼요. So then uh, what they do is uh, revealing all these inner problems and then they struggle to solve these problems. 그럼 사역자가 그 같이 살면서 그런 거 보고 그런 부분을 정확히 이게 그게 에, 정말 에, 답을 주죠. The community worker is living in the mission home together. They usually see the inner problems of these remnants and then uh, they give answers regarding the inner problems. 그러니까 바울의 신앙 고백이지만 사실은 바울의 이런 내적인 딱 응? 완전히 그냥 완전 그리스로 모든 거 그냥 다 완전 자기가 없고 어디 그저 사는 막 이런 예, 확실한 고백과 이런 신앙을 딱 우리 보여주. So Philippians chapter 3 verse 7 to 14 is, is a confession of faith, but the Paul really he showed uh, how we should live our lives and then he's really faith in Christ. 그 저는 바울을 보고요. 이거 말이죠. Looking at Paul, I also discovered this. So for Paul, what he has was only Christ. That's why he confessed that I have been crucified with Christ. That's why I no longer live in my body, but Christ, he lives in me. Even though he confessed like this, but he was a human too, so that uh, 1 Corinthians 15 31 he said, uh, I die daily. So he also tried to uh, to make himself dead every day. So realistically, it means that Paul had this kind of time. The reason I tell you every day, every time that you must focus on God through word and prayer, because uh, having this time is truly it's a power. Yeah, you truly need to experience this time and then you must be able to do this every day. So for Paul, God really allowed him to have, to be in this situation. For him, uh, no choice to be this way. Uh, Paul, he, at first, he prayed to God that to get rid of his problems. But God's answer to him was that my grace is sufficient to you. Because for you not to be arrogant, that's why I allow you to have this problem. That's why for Paul, taking his old problems as a platform, he just only entered into only Christ. That's why Paul, he really had a victory. So Satan can never win over Paul. Isn't that so? Yeah, if, while, Paul, while Paul is confessing, he said, you know, I no longer live, only Christ he lives in me. Yeah, even uh, God allowed him the sufferings, but he said, oh, I give thanks to God. So same for Satan, he couldn't really make uh, Paul fall. That's why Paul was used by God to this gospel movement to the end. So we also need to gain this same answer. So if we don't gain this answer just like Paul, then the Satan will also continue to attack us to make us fall. So realistically when you receive training, you need to receive this inner training, just like Paul. So 
불교 같은데 보면 전부 다 나를 비우라. So look at these days, uh, the three organizations and the religious organizations, uh, even the Buddhism, they say, uh, empty yourself. They receive these kind of training. Yeah, through transcendental meditation. Yeah, doing the temple stay, they try to empty themselves. Yeah, try to empty themselves. Even these people from the three organizations, they do this inner training. But what about us? Yeah, for the Buddhism, they say to the disciples, uh, you have to leave your family. Yeah, you have to stop all the relationships, human relationships. Even between parents, you have to. Yeah, on one of the brother of our elder, yeah, he's a Buddhist, so then he even stopped the discard the relationship with the parents. Yeah, they discard all the possessions of money and the relationship, and then they go to the Buddhist temple. Yeah, it means that uh, they really make people not to have any motives to follow their own religion. Even for the Buddhist, uh, sorry, the Catholic priests, they don't get married. The, as well as the nuns, they also they don't get married. So if they get married, there's a possibility for them to get into trouble easily. That's why they don't get married. 그래 그런 것들이 보면 어떤 면에서 그런 장애들이니까 그런 게 사회에 방해되니까 그게 자기가 무슨 목회 생활이나 뭐또뭐 성지 신부 생활이나 그다음에 중부 생활하는데 방해되니까 다 So in some way, getting married or these kind of things become obstacle for their ministry or their work of faith. That's why they try to get rid of all these things. 그렇죠. 그래가지고 중화다 그만 아무 어디 먹고 살게 없죠. 아무 소용 그러니까 이 사람들이. 무당도 보면 무당 하다 그만도 뭐뭐 배운 기술도 없이 뭐 아무도 없으니까 그러니까 그 모든 그 모든 또 하고 있어. So that's why for the Buddhist monk, if they stop becoming the Buddhist monk, they have no way for to feed themselves. And that's why they have to continue to become the Buddhist monk. 예, 그래 봐야 그 사람들은 사실은 영적인 모르고 진짜 사단을 모를 때문에 그런 굉장히 심각한 문제가 온 거예요. Yeah, for them, even they do that, but uh, not knowing about the spiritual problems, you know, later on the spiritual problem they will have to face. So at least three things uh, you must fulfill or you must do, do them in the midst of training. So the first is the clean heart before God. So you must have the clean heart before God. But realistically, we have so many motives within us. So actually, everything else is wrong except Christ. Yeah, because Christ is complete, Christ is perfect, so you don't actually need anything else. Especially for the evangelists, Christ is responsible for everything of the evangelists, so they don't really need anything except Christ. That's why you don't need to do evangelist movement with any motives. But unless you come to this answer, it's difficult for you to discard, throw away your motives. Unless for the evangelists come to this answer that the Christ is really everything complete and perfect, it's difficult for them to 
That's why God uses this kind of people who has a clean heart before God. So if you look at the first Samuel chapter 16, when um, the Samuel, he wanted to select a king after Saul, he saw the sons of the Jesse. But God didn't look at the appearance or the height of the person. But for Samuel, he didn't. He saw the appearance and the height of the the sons of the Jesse. That's why he looked at. Uh, he selected the the one of the sons of Jesse. But the God's view was different. That's why God said, uh, "My look at uh, people is different from men." Yeah, man looks at the outward appearance, but the Lord looks at the heart. God always uses the person who has a clean heart. God doesn't use the person who has a wrong motive. And also Daniel chapter 1a, you can see, but Daniel resolved not to defile himself with the royal food and wine. God, his, Daniel, he set his heart before God. Because of idolatry in my Israel, my country Israel became captives to Babylon, Daniel knew. Even in Babylon, he was asked to eat the food from the idolatry. That's why he set his heart. For Daniel, if he ate the food of this idolatry, he will get, he would he will gain the favor from the king. But uh, actually, what he knew was that because of idolatry, our country became. Even though I may face a lot of disadvantages not having the food, but still I cannot really take this food from the idolatry, he said. So really this is the issue or the problem of the center of heart. And also Philippians 3.14 we already have read to win the prize for which God has called me heavenward. We always look for things on this earth, but uh, Paul said that I person to take a person to win the prize for which God has called me heavenward. When you go to heaven, uh, uh, will there be any uh, prizes for you? But it's not really uh, for the sake of the prizes. Paul was doing that. But Paul, he said that uh, the, to the people of the uh, Philippians, you are the crown of my life. When you evangelize, in order to receive prizes, do you evangelize? Outwardly, you may look same evangelist, but the inner world, you can see people are different. Yeah, Paul, he also confessed that in Romans chapter 1, verse 14, I am a debtor to the Greeks. To the Gentiles, to everybody, I am a debtor. 
he also said that the God has called me to become the disciple to save all these Gentiles. 그래서 내가 복음이라는 것은 부득불하게. That's why for him he said that preaching this gospel is a really obligation before him. 그러면 안 하면 안 돼. 잘할 게 아니고 부득불하게. Yeah, it's a it's an obligation. He has to do that. 맞아, 복음 전에 알면 내가 하면. He but even he confessed that if I don't preach this gospel, I will be condemned by God. 그래서 바울은 이렇게 말해. And Paul also, Paul also he said this. 오늘 여기도 그냥 시기. First Corinthians 9:16. 나의 다리를 갈까 주에서 받은 삶이 곧 하나님의 은혜의 복음을 증언하는 일을 말씀하는 내 생명 정도 견인지 알아요? Yeah, he confessed uh, Acts chapter 20 verse 24. I consider my life worth nothing until I finish the task and the finish the race God has given me. 그러니까 to this gospel of kingdom. 어이 부시라 내가 이 가면 뭐 응? 내가 무슨 무슨 이익을 받게 된다. 그거는요. 전도자입니다. You know, to make your church grow and then to make some uh, the award or receive a reward if you evangelize, you are not a truly evangelist. There are so many people not knowing about this gospel, they are perishing, you know, they are receiving disasters. So neglecting them, you know, is is if you neglect them, you are not a really evangelist. For Paul himself, not knowing about this gospel, he suffered so much. So that's why he thought that uh, if he doesn't know the gospel, the whole world uh, don't know this gospel, he thought. 우리가 전도자가 이 중심을 내 주변에 신청해요. 올바른 깨끗한 중심 가지고 그래야지. So it truly we need to have we need to have a training to have really a clean heart before God. 디모데후서 2장 27절에. And also 2 Timothy. 자기를 깨끗하게 하면 귀히 쓰는 것이 된다. Yeah, it, it says that if a man cleanses himself, he will be an instrument for noble purposes. 여러분이 네, 그야말로 순수한 깨끗한 복음전을 통해. So you really need to have a motive to really um, preach the gospel 자, in a clean way. 뭘 알아줘야 하고 그거하고 특별히 뭐 생기가 그거 아니잖아. If you evangelize to be known by others and then to gain something, you know that's not true evangelism. 그러니까 이런 동기 빼는 훈련이 필요하도록 하나님께서 우리 훈련시키는. We truly need to have a training to get rid of our wrong motives. I already shared this with you before because I thought I'm a pastor, so I thought I did really didn't have any motives to, to do this. When I even pioneered my church, you know, I didn't have any motives. To make my church grow. That's why I thought I really don't have. So, but once I pioneered my church, I wouldn't have. I didn't have any fruits, you know, bearing. But uh, I had a fruits from a uh, very remote from my church. Uh, it was the mental hospital, you know, the mental patients became the fruits of my evangelism. I visited the mental hospital twice a week. It took so long time for me to yeah. get there. Yeah, at that time, I really, the conflict. I felt the conflict within my heart that uh, is it really true that uh, I spent so much time to evangelize these mental patients? Because the area was very remote, far away from my church, it was in Gyeongsang. So if I evangelize around my church, it would be more beneficial. I now at that time, even I thought that uh, even I preached gospel to these mental patients, even though they received the gospel, you know, you know what kind of benefit can I get? <laughs> then immediately I, you know, came to my senses that uh, oh, I also have a wrong motive within my heart. You know, I'm just an ordinary man like others. 
그게 내가 그걸 안 생각 못 해요. 무조건 대충 두 번, 그건 안 빠니까. So the moment I realize this fact, then, then I never stop uh, visiting that mental hospital. Always, twice a week, I went there. 우리가 동기라는 게참 뭐야 한두 가지. So when we talk about the motives, you know, it's gonna be so many. There, there be so many motives. 어쩌면 하나님이 우리에게 이런 부분을 훈련시키는 게 있어요. So God wants to train us regarding these motives. 그런 면에서 어쩌면 여러분 역사가 많이 알아야 할 수. Yeah, because maybe you know, because of your incorrect motives, that's why God wants to train us. 이게 안 되는 역사가 없다. 우리 그거를 못 따라. So unless you really clean your heart before God, you know, even the works arises, but uh, I don't think uh, that will continue. Yeah, even though the God's works are arising, but uh, people they just, later on they just uh, go to other church or they 그렇죠. run away. Uh, sometimes the evangelists they experience so much God's work taking place, but they, later on they, you know, just uh, pioneer their own church. And also the sometimes when God's works arising, then uh, other young people they, you know, follow after Him. Like that. Yeah, unless you have this clean heart in a clean heart before God, even the works are rising, it can be a bigger problem to you later. And then now Philippians chapter 4 verse 19. So it says God will meet all our needs. It means that the God does not uh, fill up our avarice. 이 제목대로 하나님을 향한 깨끗한 주의. So just like the title, you know, we really need to have a, a clean heart before God. 그렇죠. 그래서 우리가 하나님 앞에서. That's why we always need to stand before God. 우리가 이게 고람대라는 말. So we also use this term 고람대요. 고람대요 할말 뭐야? What does it mean? 영어로 뭐 in front of God. In English, it's uh, in front of God. 그러니까 하나님 앞에. Yeah, before God. 여러분, 늘 내가 하나님 앞에 so, you are in front of God. 그렇죠. 하나님 앞에 있다. Yeah, consider yourself you are in front of the Almighty God. 그게 어떻게 뭘 가리고 숨기는 게 있을 수 있어요? 없어요? So if you're standing in front of God, can you hide anything from you? 사람이 안 본다고 해서 안 보여서 오바지도 아니야. Yeah, but people cannot see you. That's why people they do all kinds of things, you know, behind. But for God, He is Almighty. You cannot hide. You cannot cover any, any. You cannot cover yourself with anything. You cannot lie to God, but you can lie to man, but you cannot lie to God. That's why always, you know, by yourself, you must stand before God. 여러분 하나님 앞에 서서 모든 판단은요 무슨 다른 동기 할수 없어. So even when you make a judgment, you know, always stand before God and try to make a judgment. 그렇죠. 내가 하나님 앞에서 뭐 한다 할때 그걸 어떻게 숨기 숨겨다가 할수 있겠냐? Yeah, and when you try to do something, yeah, stand before God. Can you hide anything from you? 그래서 여러분이 늘 이거 하는 하게 그 고람들. So in order to have a clean heart, you can have a quorum deo. Yeah, have a time standing before God. In the midst of doing something, always stand before God, check that whether it's correct or not doing this before God. Then immediately you will realize that oh, doing this will not please God, so then you so having this kind of time always is a, is an inner training. 그리고 참된 겸사. And then you need to have a true humility. 다니엘 2장 27절 30절 나와. If you look at Daniel chapter 2 verse 27 to 30. 
이 보니까 박사나 술기운 왕이 볼수 없는데 오직 은비라고 나타내는 자는 하늘에 계신 하나님이시라. It says no wise man or enchanter can explain these things to king, but there is a god in heaven who reveals mysteries. 그렇죠. 은비라는 것을 둘이 보이는 순간 하늘밖에 없어. Yeah, only there is a god in heaven who reveals mysteries. 그러니까 하나님 God is Almighty. He knows everything. Isaiah 42, verse 8. It says, I am the Lord, that is my name. I will not give my glory to another or may praise to idols. My praise to idols. Yeah, God says that he will not give his glory to another or or uh, his praise to idols, he said. 자, 베드전서 5장 5절에 보겠습니다. And 1 Peter chapter 5 verse 5 to 6. 젊은 자들아, 장로들의 승부하고 다 서로 겸손하게 흐르는 동이라. Yeah, he says, young men, in the same way, be submissive to those who are older. 하나님은 교만한 자를 대제하시고 겸손한 자에게 은혜 주신다. So all of you clothe yourself with the humility toward one another because 교만은 하나님의 대제자가 되어 있어요. Because God opposes the proud but gives grace to the humble. And Matthew. 결혼 겸손이 하나님과 함께하는 것이 선이라고. Ah, Micah, Micah six eight. What is good to walk humility humbly with your God. 자본 육장 십육절 십칠절. And Proverbs chapter six verse sixteen to eighteen. 하나님이 유효하는 것 싫어하는 것 뭐냐? So. What the, what is the the thing the Lord hates? Yeah, it's a haughtiness or the arrogance. It's a Satan's favorite thing. Yeah, hundred percent. If you are arrogant, you you are satisfied. And then poison that those. Yeah, you you will discard disregard others and. Uh, it becomes cause of insecurity. So what is the opposite word to haughtiness or arrogance? It's a humbleness. 자, 역대하 or humility. 26장, 26장. Second Chronicles chapter 26 verse 16. 우시아 왕이 교만해서 분양을 하다가 문둥비를 so King Uzziah became a leper because of his arrogance while he gave incense to God. 자, Daniel 5장, and Daniel chapter 5 verse 20. 네, 부관대서, and the uh, king Nebuchadnezzar, he down fell because of his arrogance. 12, 8, and 2 Corinthians 12, 8 to 9. This is the word of Paul. He said that I boast about all my weaknesses. So that the Christ's power may rest on me. So all these verses actually um, talk about the the haughtiness or arrogance. The opposite word is a uh, humility. How can you be arrogant before God? Do you have anything uh, to boast before God? That's why standing before God is so important. But all you always stand before God, that's why you try to boast yourself. But if you stand before God, there's nothing you can boast about. God never used any man uh, who is haughty. 영광을 하나님께 돌려야지 자기의 은하 영광 시작부터 그때부터 이미 하나님 떠나요. Yeah, a man should uh, give glory to God, but he seeks after his own glory, then the God's spirit will not be with him. 그렇잖아. 말은 하늘을 계속 보면 은근히 자기를 떠. Some people, even the, with their mouths, they say, "Oh, hallelujah!" But uh, actually, they try to boast themselves. 포럼도요. 하나님의 영광이 돌려야지 마치 자기가 아 자기가 막 저절로 보자. 내가 이러다 한번 그런 포럼 잡아. And also when you give forum, you actually give forum that the, oh, you are better than others, then that you are really revealing yourself, not... Uh, 
Yeah, the seven remnants, they were not tremendous, but the God who used them, He is the tremendous being. So all the community workers must have this uh, humility, true humility. So just like Paul, we should confess also, I am a sinner of all sinners. Yeah, how can I have the, the, the how can I become a, 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 a person? Paul? 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 First Corinthians 15, verse 10, he says, uh, I am what I mean is by God's grace. Even I worked harder than all other disciples. But it's, it was not done by myself. Because God's grace was not in vain in me, that's why you know I am what I am is by God's grace. And also Paul he said this. So whatever you do, whether you eat or drink, whatever you do, just do it all the, for the glory of God. So this, these are really important things. And also look at the condition of Job. All his children were dead and all his possessions have gone. So if you were Job, wouldn't you complain to God? But Job's compassion was like this, you know, I came from my mother's womb naked. I returned to the Lord even naked. So that's why it is the Lord who gives, also it is the Lord who takes away. That's why I only give glory to God. I also, he said that I also repent. Because of this, I may not uh, resent God or criticize God. Yeah, the people who were used by God, they were not the special individuals, but the people who really knew about, the people who had a really clean heart and a humility. So look at all mankind, we were bound by 12 life problems seized by Satan, but by God's grace we have been saved, we have been set free from Satan. Yeah, only you know, to be saved, God should choose us, then we can be saved. Unless by God's grace, how can we receive salvation? Yeah, that's why Paul he confessed that uh, he what he have done he has done all these hard works and then he said that I am what I am is Yeah, for him it was really a temple for him that uh, anyhow God must use someone but uh, he was the one used by God. He gave thanks to God. So truly, gospel is needed to this world, even in so many countries. That's why for this work, God has called me. Then you must be loyal and faithful to God to the end, and then you also give thanks to God because of that. It's, it's, uh, you know, for example, not knowing about this gospel, if you don't evangelize, and what would you do instead? You know, for me, I'm really thankful that uh, God actually put me uh, this line of evangelist movement, you know, this Tarapang movement. All the, the, the big church denominations of Korea, they labeled the Darapang as a heresy, but uh, I was standing in line of this Darapang and then doing this evangelist movement. Surely, I think it is uh, by God's grace for me to be in the Darapang. Unless I had uh, all the mistakes and uh, you know all the difficult experiences, I wouldn't actually um, uh, grab hold of this therapy. So if 
I, the more I look at inside of my life, then and I can true, I can really realize that it's all by God's grace. 그러니까 바울이 그런 게 아니까요. 진짜 바울. 고난 나무도 방 감사하고, 그렇죠? 복음 때문에 피파받는 거 감사. For Paul, he know about he knew about all these things. That's why even being persecuted or being suffer being suffered, he always gave thanks to God. 자, 이런 외적으로 중요한 내 깨끗한 하나님의 주심과 참된 겸손. 정말 하나님 알면 참된 겸손. So that's why uh, for the evangelist, having a clean heart and a true humility is really really important. But if you truly understand God. You have no choice but to have these things. And then, number three is a living faith. Yeah, it's not dead faith, but it's a living faith. Yeah, Hebrew chapter 1 verse 6 says, God makes no mistakes. He's absolutely correct and undoubtedly carries out His promises. Unless uh, without, I mean, if you don't have faith, how can you please God? So without faith, Yeah, what pleases God is not a lot of ministries, but the, your faith. Yeah, truly you believe in God. That. Yeah, well, I'm not talking about the, you know, Doctrine uh, of faith, but uh, living faith. For some people, they really memorize all the doctrines of the faith, but uh, the realistic lifestyle is totally different. So, when you have a ministry with other people, then you can see whether really this person has a true faith in God or not. Oh, here Hebrew 1 6 that the God makes no mistakes. And God is absolutely correct and God undoubtedly carries out his promises. I said this before, absolutely God fulfills all supplies all our needs. Absolutely God will fulfill all our needs. 여러분, 어, 어, 무슨, 어, 그 필요하지 않기 때문에 안 주는 거야. Because the reason God doesn't give you is that because you don't have the need. 하나님 뭐한테 필요한데 우리가 뭐한테 필요한지 몰라. Yeah, in God's eyes, actually, you don't need anything. That's why God doesn't give you. But in your eyes, you think that, that you may need all these things. 그리고 하나님 뭐한테 열매를 주신다. And also, God gives uh, fruits. 그리고 하나님은 절대적인 것이다. And God is an absolute being. He is an absolute. So he really controls all our life and death and our future. He controls everything. So realistically, uh, having faith in God is important. So all the individuals of Hebrew chapter 11, they all realistically believe in God. Yeah, they believe in God in a critical situation. At the brink of death, they believe in God. In some way, God may have tested them their faith. Because the living faith has something to do with, uh, it relates to your vessel. So God always answers to you uh, looking at your vessel of faith. Yeah, even God, He tested Abraham. Abraham God tested his uh, Abraham's faith. 그렇죠. 다음에, yeah, God gave Isaac uh, at the hundred years of age of Abraham, and then He said, uh, Give your son as a sacrifice. 그리고, yeah, look at this. Uh, giving uh, the child at the age of 100, and then uh, it, he says that uh, offer your son as a sacrifice. What would you do? But the Bible says that the God wanted to test, test Abraham. Abraham. 
Uh, but Abraham, he received so many trainings. He really was trained as well. He got rid of he got rid of, he got rid of all the elements of unbelief, but he uh, 여러분, 히브리서 11장 보면 아브라함 어떻게 믿냐 하면 내가 이 아들 번지를 발리치면 하나님이 다시 살릴 것을 믿었다고 How, he, how Abraham believed in God in Hebrew 11 he says that uh, if I offer my son as a sacrifice God would give him, give him giving me back the son, my son again 그러니까 그런 믿으니까 뭐 발치기 쉬운 거야 뭐 다시 살 것인가 yeah, because he had this kind of faith, so offering his son as a sacrifice was not that difficult thing to do. 그러니까 yeah, it means that he really had an absolute faith in God. 여러분이 이세 가지 분량입니다. So you truly, as an evangelist, you need to have these three trainings. 어떤 여러분이 시험이 올때 하나만 이걸 테스트하고 So in case you face with the trials, then the God... 그렇죠. God may test you. It means that the God is asking you, do you truly believe in me? But some cases, some people, they really have to believe, truly believe at the moment, but they don't believe. They're that's why we need to have this. So as you live life of an evangelist, you really need to have this inner training of yourself. Isn't that so? Yeah, because God is Almighty. God can even attach uh, people to be evangelized to you today, but if works arises, you know, what about your inner training, your inner lifestyle? It cannot be changed, it will remain the same. Uh, uh, actually, I I said I'm going to invite Pastor Christopher and our elder Lee. Oh, oh, actually, I didn't invite this Pastor Christopher, but uh, he actually said to Elder Lee that uh, he was invited by Pastor Shin. Yeah, even the elder Lee was populist because uh, Pastor Shin never had said that he is going to invite pa uh, Pastor Christopher to Korea. Yeah, actually inviting other pastors to Korea is not by myself, it's our church is doing that. <laughs> So I'm doing my ministry with the other uh, defendant churches pastors together, but some cases, you know, because they don't have the you know finances, then they have kind of They have a weak points in the you know in finances matter. So then. That's why sometimes I tell them that uh, because of this, you know, your vessel is you know, like this, then uh, you know you will become uh, dependent uh, all, you know, all the more. I mean, your entire life. Yeah, even the dependent churches, they can do missions too because you can pray to God. Yeah, 
하나님 보통 믿음을 그렇게 안 돼요. Yeah, look at God's level. Don't look at your own level. You know, if you always say that, oh, our church is, uh, you know, not uh, rich enough to do missions. 그리고 then, 자꾸 동기를 나타내면 하나님 보통 별로 좋아하지 않습니다. You you confess like this, and you know, I don't think God will be pleased with that. 에 여러분이 뭐 그런 얘가 맞냐 말 모르겠지만 우리 너무 우리 주변은 진짜 우리 실제로 잘 들어가고요. 너무 이런 부분이 맞거든요. I don't know whether the example I gave to you is correct or not, but uh, in our um, around, there are so many people just uh, like this having wrong views. Or... 그러니까 God is Almighty. We always need to stand before God, but some people they always try to look at others, you know. Um, opinions and then they 아, 그래. try. 쳐다보고, 뭐, try to be aware of others. 거지, yeah, they don't look at God but they look at people and then they try to do their ministry. 음. 여러분, 우리, 에, 이 부분이 바울이 했던 것처럼 우리도 실제로 이런 부분을 훈입시다. So this, the training, this training, what Paul he did. So we also need the same training, just like Paul. 많이 부딪히든 정말로 여러분이 이런 부분에 이게 내적 훈련 생각하고요. 정말로 이게 너무. If you discover yourself having problems with all these three areas, then the, you really need to pray to God, 그렇죠. and then you must. 한마디로 하나님 앞에. Transcend these problems. The only method is uh, you really need to stand before God. 결국은 안 된다 말 하나님 안 믿는다 말이고 지금 하나님 앞에. If you confess these things are impossible for you, then it means you don't believe in God. 그럼 여러분 도표를 그리고 진짜 들어보세요. 내가 십자가 신앙, 부활 신앙, 이런 성취 신앙, 계림 신앙. When you draw the gospel chart, uh, be reminded of the cross faith, resurrection faith, ascension faith, and the second advent faith. So you must become a person uh, that has no choice to be used by God. Look at uh, you know the world that uh, there are 237 countries in the world. There are even so many countries that never heard of this gospel. God's will is a gospel to be preached to all these nations. So if even if you are just equipped just a little bit of these things, these training, then, then you know God can use you. And then there are so many uh, golden fisheries around us. But uh, if you have the wrong motives or if you're not trained in this, then the, how God can use you? So truly have time of having Quran Try to get rid of yourself and then, you know, let the Christ really control you. Yeah, truly God's kingdom must be established in your inner self first. Yeah, the God's kingdom where Christ is the ruler or Christ reigns. Yeah, let the Christ completely seize you or take you. 그렇죠. If you concern about yourself, if you follow your own motives, your own standard, then you have no choice but to seize by Satan. So this is what it means that uh, you have to make the 21 points of life to be essence of your life. So truly you have to make the Christ kingdom of God filling of the Holy Spirit to become your imprint root and nature. So then whatever inside of you doesn't matter. 
Yeah, in some way, the things have become imprinted in you. It's hard to take them out. 복음을 관절 가게 뿌리시겠다. But opposite way, imprint the gospel within yourself. 그렇잖아. 그 길밖에 없어. That's the only method. 그럼 그게 되는 만큼 수분한 가지 보이 되는 만큼 사실 이런 부분이 이렇게 참된 겸손으로 이렇게 올바른 우리 중심으로 해보자. So to the point that the, the 21 points to become your essential points of life, then uh, your imperial nature also will change. So I already mentioned this before, but uh, you know these three organizations and uh, Buddhism, they always uh, focus on the inner But we for us, we need to be aware of the spiritual 그렇죠. reality. Yeah, on this, uh, you know, God can work, but the opposite on this, uh, Satan, he will be the ruler or he will do work. 그렇죠. Yeah, your motive, if, if that becomes the channel of Satan, yeah, if your unbelief uh, it becomes your the, becomes the channel of Satan. Then, no reason for you to have. Uh, 네, 거만이, 거만이 the and also, your arrogance can be the channel of Satan for you to crumble. 이런 부분을 여러분이요 내 내면의 문제이기 때문에 괜찮아. 여러분 자신이 안 하면 안 돼요. So, 그거 뭐냐 봐도. All these things are the actually the problems of inner world nobody knows so you yourself need to deal with this. 여러분이 이걸 하는 이걸 이 이런 거 하는 내재 훈련은 그게 여러분이 영적 시스템 아니에요. So having a training of uh, all this is actually you are establishing your spiritual system. 영적 시스템 맞으세요? Yeah actually it's the way to for you to come to spiritual summit. 여러분, That's why when you do the prayer journal, don't just simply look at the, don't simply read the books, but uh, watch the video message and then transcribe the message. 그냥 So don't simply just hold on to the covenant, but uh, realistically hold on to the covenant. Yeah, the covenant must become your imprint and nature must enter into you. 그리고 우리가 깊은 호흡 가지고 진짜 우리 성령이 정말 어려운 이 권세. So together with the deep breathing exercise, you really need to pray to God, the uh, Christ, the kingdom of God, and the Holy filling of the Holy Spirit. 그렇죠. 그게 이 사실 갖고 여러분 이렇게 틈탈 뜻이 없어요. Once you become uh, 24 hours with the Christ kingdom of God and filling the Holy Spirit, then uh, Satan. Has no can have a foothold. So you really need to establish a system where you can have all this training. Even for you, you don't have your system to have all these uh, trainings, you know, you will also crumble because you cannot be used by God to the end. Yeah, also it's another reason is that because you are so important and also God wants to use you, that's why you really need to establish a system. Why we are in need of mission home? Because in the mission home, you, we can carry out this training. So so these multi-ethnic uh, community workers or the people, even though they receive the gospel, but that they are in a world we don't know. But if we live together in the mission home, we will know what kind of problems in the inner world of themselves they have. Right. Yeah. 
자기도 가져왔다는 거야. So in when I went to Taiwan, I really see the inner problem of people there because they were really imprinted with the Confucianism. Because uh, when the Taiwan, when they come to this Taiwan, the people, Chinese people, they also brought together with the Confucianism from mainland China. Oh, the Pekin Wu Zhang, the Wu Wang, ah, that guy, the other guy, doesn't come together. 자꾸 나 얘기하면 뭐 옳거든 내가 나세 말할 거야 나 그때부터 시타이 와 안달한다 So that's why you know in Taiwan there is a Dr. Dr. Wu because he he also was imprinted with this Confucianism he says that women must not come out in the front 유리야 유리야 이게 남자 여자는 자유 남자 순정이라고 뭐 One of the doctrine of the Confucianism is that the women should be silent. You know, they shouldn't stand out before men. 그래 그런 게 들어가죠. 보험도 사나없어. 자기 그거 안 받는 안 받는 일이니까 그게 어떻게 이 사단의 돈안 되겠나? For him, even though he received the gospel, he accepted Christ, but he still become imprinted with all these, you know, Confucianism. That's why. You know, it can become the Satan's channel. You know, for him. 그러니까 그 나라 사람들의 민족성이 그저 그 나라 민족성이 각인되는 그런 부분이 아 공자다. So from this, I realized that the, even the country Taiwan, all the people they become imprinted with the, this ideology of a Confucian. 그 부분을 안 바뀌지만 사회자들이 그런 거 그대로 갖고 있으면 뭐 돈도 안 나와. 이게요. 우리가 겉으로 보면 모르잖아요. 아니 그게 신통돼서 다 나타난다니까. Unless you change this kind of ideology of the committed workers in Taiwan, even though they receive the gospel, but uh, their inner actually the thinking will not be changed. You know. 고구마가 많이 그 가감이 버려줘야 되는데 그걸 그거 이게 무슨 그걸 고집을 갖고 있는 사람들 그 고집 때문에 이런 사람들. If the inner thinking of themselves, like uh, this kind of ideology, doesn't match with the gospel, they should, you know, boldly get rid of all their thinkings, uh, previous thinkings. But That's why we are having mission homes, you know. In the mission homes, we live together for a certain period. That's why all your inner problems, your inner lifestyle will be revealed. Then the community workers can deal with the inner problems and give you the answer. Then eventually you change, then you can be used as an evangelist later. Because we Boba, can we move from the day to go? Huh? Because we don't have mission homes. 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 So even for our Boba, he uh, he he must be trained himself first, and then he can also open a mission home, and he can also train other workers. Well, we are not only talking to them, but the culture was good in Bukhara. So when you sometimes say that oh, our country is like this because our country yeah. blah blah, then it means that you are still bound by your country. We are not only talking about our country, but we are not only talking about our country. 그런 생각이 마음이 묶이시면 그래서 그 자체로 다른 점. Even if uh, you know, if you are still bound by your culture, your own culture of your own country, then you know that actually that doesn't match with the gospel. Then you have to really get rid of all the culture that doesn't match with the gospel. 우리 안에 많이 그래. But you know, inside of us already, so many these things become imprinted. 대체 우리 대체. It's an inner training. So for the evangelists, they must have this inner training in themselves. Yeah, just like Paul, you know, uh, everything else is uh, rubbish except the gospel. Yeah, for Paul, everything else was rubbish except the gospel. You know Paul, what kind of person he was? He was a uh, actually very thorough Jew. 그렇죠. 철저한 유대주의자예요. 그런 사람이 이방석이었다니까. So he was a really a thorough a Jew, or he was in the Jewish. 이방의 사도라고. 
but he became the uh, disciple to the Gentiles. 그러니까 그 내적 분류 안 되시면 어떻게 이방 선정? But unless he had this inner training, changing himself, how could he become the Gentile? I mean, the disciple to Gentiles. 그러니까 안디옥 교회 여기 보면요 이런 부분 로스 때문에 하는 안디옥 교회 있어요. Look at Antioch Church in the Bible, because Antioch Church they all transcended this problem 그렇죠. of their inner world. 인종주의 넘어서고 민주주의 넘어서고 국가주의 넘어서니까 하나님 그 나라 세계 모습. They were able, they were, they were able to do the word even this, and that God used them. 자, 여러분 이거 우리 지금 해외 사민자도 마찬가지로 이런 훈련이. Even for all our overseas community workers, you need this training. Let's pray. Father God, we thank you. We are evangelists. We are evangelists. So this uh, inner world, inner training that all the evangelists must receive, help us to receive the training too. So all the inner motives that are hidden within us, Come our arrogance, 불신한, our unbelief, so please root this them out. Yeah, we don't have any strength to get rid of all these uh, inner roots, so please uh, help us to be with the feeling of the Holy Spirit and then help us to imprint this gospel and imprint Help us to change all our imprint root nature into Christ's kingdom of God, filling of the Holy Spirit. Uh, just like Paul, help us to do this uh, 24 hours a day. Help us to have this system. Then we help us to become the evangelists uh, that, that are uh, no choice but to be used by God. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Amen.